Well, a Central Florida police officer is fired, and it's all linked to this incident captured on body cam video. DeLand police say the officer used excessive and unreasonable actions when arresting a man last year. News 6's Nadine Yanis joins us now live from the DeLand Police Department with more on how it all unraveled. Mm. Matt, you said it. This stems from an incident in September of 2017. This now former DeLand officer, Joey Malera, was training another officer for being too timid when the two were called out to a scene for someone yelling at cars. That's when the chief says they came face to face with a man who was wrongfully arrested. That man filing a lawsuit, and now that officer is out of a job tonight. Get away from me. Sit over there. You're pushing me away from you? Yeah, I don't need you stepping up to me like that. Sit down. Stepping up to you? Sit down or I'm going to sit you down. I wasn't stepping up to you, sir. Sit okay. down. Sit down. Do you understand that? According to the conclusion of an internal affairs investigation, DeLand police officer Joey Malero, seen here on the city of DeLand's Facebook page with a canine, was the one in this video. Overly aggressive, rude, and loud to a man the police chief says shouldn't have even been arrested to begin with. Do you have ID on you, sir? Yes, sir. I okay. sure do. I don't understand why you why you're doing this. Why you're pushing because me I don't like people testing me. I don't like people I don't not like my Nazis order. either. Okay. The incident took place back in September of 2017 after there were reports that someone was yelling at cars. However, Internal Affairs said there was no crime committed and in turn no reason for this man's arrest. In fact, his charges were dropped by the state attorney and the city had to pay up in a lawsuit filed by the guy. The FDLE even investigated the officer's use of force and though they determined Molero didn't commit a crime, they thought his actions were troublesome and worrisome. The chief deciding to fire the officer this morning, releasing this statement in part shortly after, saying the majority of his officers show patience and restraint. Quote, however, there are many times when our actions do not come anywhere near achieving the standards of excellence that we have set for our officers at the DeLand Police Department. Unfortunately, this is one of those times. And today we spoke to the city of DeLand spokesperson who says the chief was not going to have this kind of behavior, which is why he was fired today. We're going to also learn why this incident has sparked change in the department's policy. What has changed, Matt, in my story tonight? at seven o'clock.